Middle Tennessee playing in its final road game of the season in its third contest versus Bowling Green. And the Hornets Demarius Smith avoids the clothesline and dunks it home as Bowling Green goes up 6-2. The Storm trying to keep the score close as Miles Thrash gets it up to Roy McFadden as Middle Tennessee pulls within two. But with seconds remaining in the first, Chris Capuchian, who knocked down five of nine triples, gives Bowling Green the 27-19 lead heading into the second. And that lead gets stretched to double digits with Capuchian, who had a team-high 22 points. On the other end of the floor, Fabian Laurent drives baseline as the Hornets' lead is cut to 8, 29 to 21. But Bowling Green keeps its foot on the pedal as Monty Burney hits the scoop shot to start a 34 to 12 Hornet run. Capuchian knocks down another. Daquan Brown left all alone on the elbow. Brown, who was three of seven from downtown, grabs another. Then back to Smith with the one hand slam. Bowling Green up 63 to 33 entering the third quarter. And after Darius Ingram's layup, the Hornets have their largest lead of the game at 35 points. Then Middle Tennessee's thrash went to work. He scored 10 points in the third and had a game high 37 points shooting 14 of 30 from the field. Thrash has played in three games this season and leads the league, averaging 27.3 points per game. But Thrash's magic would not be enough on this night as Bowling Green wins it 122 to 98. Middle Tennessee's Roy McFadden sets a new CBA record with 27 rebounds. But the Storm, which has lost their last six games, will host Illinois on May the 6th, and they will finish their regular season in last place. Bowling Green will travel to Mississippi on May the 6th before returning home on Sunday to host Illinois in the final regular season CBA game. The Hornets only need to win one of their last two games to secure a playoff spot. 